Today we'll develop a 3D logo mockup. So go to File and do Page Setup. Now let me open one background here. So let me select this background. Now drag this background to our mockup tab and release it here. Click on Yes. And now delete this image tab. Now make it a little bit smaller and drag it and fill the uh, page completely. And mark it. Now delete this original background. Uh, make duplicate this background layer and uh, we'll work on this new layer now so go to filter and uh, here is a blur Gaussian blur and here give some Gaussian blur effect click OK now create a new layer and to this new layer uh, draw a rectangle from here here to here and use some gradient effects so select this gradient and now uh, reduce the opacity now select them and do right click and merge layers now create a new layer from here and to this new layer we'll do some transformation which will directly impact on the logo so to this new layer let me first rename this new layer place place your logo here and let me rename this background so here what we'll do We'll draw a rectangle now from here to here and let me fill this with white color. Now whatever transformation we'll do to this rectangle, it will impact on our logo. So let me do right click here and convert to smart object and now rotate it a little bit to this direction like that and mark it now double click here and place your logo so I'll open one of my logo so let me use this logo and place it here click yes and unmark this background and close the tab click on yes and here you can see the impact of uh, angle rotation and let me delete this tab now let me use some effects to this logo so do double click here and from here you can choose gradient overlay click here and from here you can choose gradient color so let me make this one zero opacity click OK and instead of dissolve luminosity and here let's change the direction of the effect and instead of reflected let's check with diamond setting you can check it this is a nice effect you can click here and you can choose colors and you can fix the angle 120 degree and you can check with different color effects from here and this bevel and emboss this is very important one so click here 
and you can reduce the depth if you want check with the direction which one you think that is the perfect you you just pick up that now click on drop shadow and here use drop shadow so here I'll change the angle of the drop shadow and distance I'll reduce it little bit size I'll make it bigger spread now create a new layer so from the toolbar select this ellipse tool and here draw a circle let's draw a big circle like that and fill with gradient color and instead of linear select this radial and here the black one make zero opacity and the white one make twenty three click OK and now you can reverse it now drag it and make duplicate and place this one here and place this one here so now we are done up to this and select them all by pressing control key on your keyboard select them and now group now double click here and uh, let's check with some different logo how it appears so I'll be using this logo now let me drag it to that tab and place it here click on yes and place at the middle unmark this logo and close it click on yes so now let's check the result yeah, it looks great. Hope you learn how to design a 3D logo mockup. Thank you for being a part of Graphic Island.